What's the best way to sound smart even when you isn't? The smartest people I know aren't embarrassed when they don't know something. Be inquisitive and actively want to learn. Listen more than you talk. Using big words when you and your audience don't know what they mean can make you appear more photosynthesis. Ambidextrously speaking, I'd have to agree. Develop your vocabulary and don't speak in cliches. Or only speak in cliches. Listen more than talk and ask context relevant questions. I generally just keep my mouth shut and don't take sides in a debate. Apparently, if I'm never disagreeing with you, then I appear to be very smart indeed. Wear glasses, then take them off, cross your arms, put an end in your mouth, look up at nothing and whisper, fascinating. This works especially well at museums. My favorite is to take off my glasses, look at something contemplatively, begin to express appreciation on my face, and slowly replace that expression with one of disgust. Then I will wipe one of my glasses off using a handkerchief as I bitterly state, I hate it, and walk away shaking my head. Don't try too hard and only talk when you have something to contribute. I think knowing when to be quiet can be very powerful. My name is Jeff. I have no idea, but people I know say I'm smart and act like I'm smart, despite the fact that I'm a dumbass. The only reason I can figure is my parents are older, so my vocabulary is out of date sometimes. And my dad was a professor, so I just have a number of history and art facts in my small talk repertoire. It sort of sounds like gloating to say people say I'm smart, but I'm really, really not trying to talk myself up. I don't understand a lot of things. I mostly am able to regurgitate information. It's kind of uncomfortable because people say I'm smart. I say I'm not. They think I'm being modest, so I just have to accept a compliment I don't deserve. I guess talk fast and know a lot of skin deep random facts. I think most people know a lot about a couple things. So if you have random facts about a lot of things, people think you must know a lot about all of them instead of a little about a lot of them. Ask if they concur. I don't know to be honest. What I do know is how to bait people that think they are smart thanks to this post. They'll try to correct your grammar in the most condescending way, but an individual of intelligent regard will understand the joke. Did that make me sound smart? know just a little bit of a wide variety of different topics. People often think I'm smart for it, but I don't have any deep knowledge of anything. If you can't blow them away with your brilliance, baffle them with your bullshit. Stay silent. As Spongebob would say, pinky up. All right, first of all, G. Fantano, it was Patrick, and it wasn't about being smart, it was about being fancy. Get it right. That's just fancy talk. If you wanna be fancy, hold your pinky up like this. The higher you hold it, the fancier you are. How's that? Higher. Like that? Now that's fancy. In the workplace, don't share too many of your personal opinions and do not complain, at least not voice it. Several coworkers of mine can't pass a day without complaining about something, which to me makes them seem pretty dumb or at least a lack of self-awareness. Say, actually, pause, it depends. Admit when you don't know something rather than bluffing through. With friends, just look it up on your phone. At work, say you want to check the details of that before you move forward. Go back to your desk and panic. Ask, does this scale? Read the summary of a book and act like you know. I was always told better to keep silent and be thought a fool than to open one's mouth and remove all doubt. Wear glasses and a Rick and Morty t-shirt. Subscribe for more and thanks for watching. I'm Pickle Rick! Whoop-a-lub-a-dub-dub! I'm Kendall Rick! 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 I'm Kendall Rick! Rick! Rick!